You can literally learn what a specific animal looks like by simply knowing their name. The silverback gorilla has a silver back. The ridgeback dog has a ridge of hairs along its back. The redback spider has a red marking on its abdomen. And the milkback Pusalia levis has a back the colour of milk. Not only are there two different colours of milkback, grey milkback and orange milkback, but there are also two different strains. One strain comes from the common grey morph and the other strain comes from the dairy cow morph. Knowing the type of strain you have is a very important bit of information to know about your colony, especially if you are planning to eventually breed different morphs together. Dairy cow Pasalia levis are actually a subspecies of Pasalia levis. Because of very acute differences in their genitalia, dairy cows cannot successfully breed with other morphs. So, if your milkbacks originally came from a dairy cow colony, you won't be able to breed them with other Pacellia levis morphs. This is to be said about the ghost Pacellia levis as well, which can also come from dairy cows. More information about the ghost morph can be found in this video. But for all of those Australian isopod keepers, you won't have to worry about figuring out what strain your milkbacks or ghosts are because dairy cow Pacellia levis are not available in Australia. So all of our morphs come from the same species. And that marks the end of this video. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any future content.